These makeup wipes. No, no jokes here. I know I'm about to make a bold statement. What other color? What color's missing? You tell me what color is not in this palette. Right. Anyway. your girl Ajana welcome back to my channel if you're new here make sure you subscribe down below and if you're returning hey so as you guys can see I'm giving you guys the first ever unboxing haul on this channel this is gonna be from the crayon case which is a makeup company that I literally love I have a couple of things from them that I already bought before this haul so I'm gonna show you guys that as well just might as well throw that on in here because I didn't do a video when I got them so got you guys let's get to it okay so I definitely probably could have waited a little bit to show you guys first but I literally was so excited that I already busted the box open like it's literally already open so that just goes to show you how excited I am okay okay to open up the box it comes like this how freaking cute I don't know why but I love black detailing on uh, packaging gotta pose for a thumbnail Hopefully we got the thumbnail. <laughs> but yeah, so this is what it comes like, guys. And I'm going to show you guys what's inside. I'm gonna try to change the angle of the camera so you guys can see how it looks like from my view a little bit. So let's do that. This is what it looks like. And then when you open it, ah. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got and the things that I already had before this haul. So I'm gonna start off with the stuff that I already had before I ordered this stuff. And the stuff that I use already on the daily is the matte book i literally love this thing it has all the colors you probably could ever think of honestly like what other color what color is missing you tell me what color is not in this palette right anyway so i love this palette so much so this one is called the matte book um uh, honestly where is my blush palette have a blush palette too so the other thing that I have from them is the watch me blush palette this is so cute um I honestly wasn't sure like this is gonna sound really stupid but I wasn't sure if this was like eyeshadow or just blush but it's definitely most definitely some shadows um you can use some of these as blush I'm sure that um you wouldn't be the first person ever to use eyeshadow as blush I've done it before um but these colors are super cute i don't know if you guys can tell but my fingers have already been like all through these so they look kind of like you know messy but i love that it comes with a mirror it still has the plastic on it so that's why it looks all crazy but it comes with a mirror we love to see that especially when you're trying to do your makeup fast or you're not at home and all those times when you're just like i need something now so i have those and i also had a pack of ink pens before i ordered this and if you guys are like what are ink pens then i'm going to show you guys in this haul because i definitely ordered more was I supposed to? Mm, but I did. So anyway, let's get to it. So right on top are my packs of ink pens. So this is what the pack looks like. I ordered two of these. Basically, this is just like a pack of makeup brushes. But I feel like these are the most like essential brushes, if that makes sense. Um, they are numbered one through four. She has a number for each one of her brushes. Um, I'm going to try to show you guys like push them out of the plastic and try to push them let you guys see them let you guys see what we're working with so this is what they look like please focus camera perfect this is what they look like um so there's a black fluffy brush there's one that's fluffy as well but it's a little bit um less dense than this one and then there's an angle brush slanted you can use that for like liner and smudging and then there's just this flat yellow brush which is really good for focus <laughs> which is really good for um cut creases and all that types of stuff so these are the ink pens and again i told you guys i got two of these because i literally am just so obsessed with like using um fluffy brushes that i mix mine up and then i end up losing them because they're my favorite types of brushes Cause they can just you can use a fluffy brush on your eye on your face on literally everything so i love fluffy brushes the next thing that i got was this um brush cleaner i don't know if my 
camera's gonna focus. This brush cleaner was the next thing that I got. And honestly, I'm way too excited for this than I probably should be. Um, I have never used one of the sponge um, brush cleaners. I've always just done it the, the original way. I just go in the sink and take some soap, scrub them, try to get all the color out. But this claims to completely get rid of color without water. So on the back it says, glide eyeshadow against black sponge to remove color. Sponge can be washed with the fragrance free soap and warm water. Lay flat to dry. And that's literally it. So the idea behind this bad boy is that you could use a color like doo -doo 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 -doo, and then once you wanna use the brush again, you just swipe it across and then it should get rid of the color, not be wet and ready to use again. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. It's just like a black sponge, literally. But it's not wet, it's completely dry. So I'll definitely update you guys on how this works and let you know if I love it, which I think I will because no water, instant use, duh, like, come on. So then the next thing I got is this super cute um, crayon case lipstick. I'm not sure if this is like a lipstick or a lip gloss, I'm gonna be honest. I got it in the color Hell City. So we don't find out what whole city looks like. If it's like the sample on the outside, then I'm guessing it's some type of really pretty pink. Um, I plan on using this pink to use on some brown liner, you know, make it, make it pop in the center of my mouth. Oh wow, this packaging is not what I expected. So this is what it looks like like not gonna focus but this is what it looks like it's got the black ombre into the color which is kind of key there we go the applicator looks like a regular doe foot um the color you guys can kind of see it here but i'm gonna swatch it for you don't mind my hand there's swatches from earlier yes i know um so i'm gonna swatch it like that and that's what we're working with um, that's a really pretty color actually. It's gonna go very well with the perfect brown liner. I can see it now. So that one is Hell City, love that. And then next I just picked up some makeup wipes. But honestly guys, okay, honestly, let's talk about these makeup wipes because these makeup wipes, no, no jokes here. I know I'm about to make a bold statement. I'm about to make a really bold statement, especially in the makeup community. These wipes are better than Neutrogena wipes, okay? These are better. I don't even know how to explain it. Just one swipe and everything is gone. It doesn't leave your face dry or anything like that. It smells really good. These are perfect. I feel like you just kind of have to use these to understand what I'm saying. But to prove to you guys that they're really that good, I bought two packs. Does that prove it? I had one pack previous to this and I literally have been addicted ever since. So now I order in bulk. I will never order just one pack again. So there's reference for you on those. And then I got another brush. Now this brush came um, individual and I really like it and I really wish that I would have gotten two but I only got one. Um, this is their 9am brush. I'm gonna take it out of this package so you guys can see it. Wow, it's really soft. Oh. Well, damn. Okay guys, well I definitely just got the lipstick on this brush so ignore that but it's supposed to be white. There's a little bit of lipstick on it, I just did by accident. But yeah, this is the 9am brush. It's just really a fluffy brush. It's like one of those essentials. I could see myself using this to dust off the powder from underneath my eyes or add powder underneath my eyes. So I'm excited to use this. And lastly, I got the Composition Notebook, which is a play on a contour palette. And I thought it was really, really cute. I'm gonna have all the um, prices and stuff list listed below, so you guys don't have to wonder. But this is the Composition Notebook. How freaking cute is this? Um, so basically you open it up and there's, it looks like two shimmery shades and the rest are matte. Um, so this is what they look like. So these two are gonna be the two shimmers and then the rest are matte. The names are really cute. So there's Pink Me, Trophy, Ross, Bricky, Raven, and Bobby. I could really see myself using Bobby the most. Um, Bobby's this really pretty brown color. But yeah, just wanted to try this out. I wanted to see how I could play with my cheeks, do different dimensions, all that good stuff. So we're gonna see how that one works out. But that was actually the last item that I got from the crayon case. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys get to try some of these products and I'll definitely give you guys an update on how they work for me. And if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe down below and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.